Hey fellow agents, Brother Bobby here with another Division video. And today I'm giving you an in-depth look at the build I'm using in the Dark Zone. If you like what you see, please leave a like and a comment. It really does help a brother out. And if you haven't yet, subscribe to my channel. Enjoy! First off, as you can see, my primary DPS is 117,000. Got 126,000 health. And I'm skilled, my skill power is at 10,000. Um, how I'm able to pull that off with my electronics being low is uh, with modifiers. I have the stamina modifier on pretty much all of my gear. And most of the stamina modifiers have skill power to them. Well, that one has 2% haste, but I guess I should change that to something else. I'm using the vector. I've got headshot and optimal range on my sight. I've also crafted stability and critical hit damage on my muzzle break. I like accuracy and hip fire accuracy on that. And my extended mag has 103 magazine and the rate of fire is up to 27%. So it gives me a 40 mag uh, magazine. I'm also using a classic M1A. I hope to get a um, high-end drop soon. Here are the specs on that. Moving on to my gear. I'm using the tactical vest with uh, reckless increased damage by 13% and increased income and damage by 10%. Um, <clears throat> an item level 31. It gives me a 46% ammo capacity. So I really like that. Rehabilitated feels two percent every time you during a status uh, during status effects, or two percent every second during status effects. I apologize. Twenty three percent scavenging, and it also has two mod slots, which I really like. Got the tactical knee pads on. I'm trying to get all my gear to have more critical hit chance and critical hit damage. Um, however, it's harder to come by than I thought, so I'm currently still working on that. All of the items that I'm using are um, level 31 or item level 31 so as you can see my major attributes on this one is critical hit chance SMG damage and damage to elites headshot damage or headshots with this with the sidearm deals 25 percent more damage so So there you go as far as my gear. I'm running at my critical hit chance, or weapon damage at 8,000, critical hit chance at 44%, critical hit damage at 71%, headshot damage at 72%. Um, moving on to other things that uh, matter, let's see. My survivability. Armor's at 3,700. I heard you can max it out at 6,500, but I'm not sure. But it allows me to mitigate 52% of incoming weapon damage, which I like. Mm. 
As far as my abilities go, I'm using Pulse, First Aid, and Survivor Link. Critical Save. Use a medical kit, or use a med kit during low health to increase damage resistance by 40%. I'm also using Combat Medic. Use a med, med kit near allies to heal group members and proxies within 20 meters by 40%. What's really nice about this is even if you're running solo, uh, you ca yourself counts as an ally, so it actually gives you the 40% as well. One is none, headshots to a hostile. I have a 50% chance to not be consumed, uh, not, not consume a bullet. Uh, that's really nice, especially if you like sniper rifles and you're really good at precision shots. And then on the move, kill a hostile while moving to reduce incoming damage by 30%. So I hope uh, that helped guys. I apologize for my um, monotone in this video. I'm not feeling too well today. Um, but yeah, there you have it. If there's anything I missed, let me know in the comment section down below. Uh, also, um, you know, please subscribe to my channel. It really helps a brother out. And... Yeah.